Let's rank these mega Pokemon sets, these build your pixel art sets in order from my favorite to my least favorite here. So on your left hand side, my right hand side, I'm gonna go with my favorite all the way to my least favorite. They're not in order yet. Now, if you're interested in the full set reviews of all four of these, I have each one of them individually on the page uh, with a full set review. These are $25 sets. And if y'all are new here, please slap that subscribe button. You need tons of Lego content, Star Wars Lego, dabbing a little bit into the, uh, the Mega World, mostly Pokemon and Halo, but let's do this. So, and by the way, these are awesome sets. Just gonna be honest with you. I think for $25, they are well worth it. So my number one favorite set here is the Bulbasaur set. I think it just looks the most accurate. Like when you look at it, I can just see Bulbasaur. And for me, it just, it's my favorite. I'm hoping that Mega does some other sets uh, like this, because these are obviously the four starter Pokemon, but I'm hoping that they do some more like this. Now, my number two is going to be Charmander. Now, this isn't an order of my favorite Pokemon or anything. This is just an order of how I think these sets look. So, so far, Bulbasaur is number one, Charmander is number two, and then we have to figure out here what the last two will be. Uh, and I'm going to be honest with you, this is the order. Uh, Pikachu goes three and Squirtle goes next. I just think that the Squirtle one lacked, like, the look of the Squirtle. Like, it just isn't as recognizable uh, and it's not my favorite. Uh, I'm not saying that Squirrel's not a cool Pokemon or anything, but I just don't think that uh, Mega did a great job with the uh, Squirtle one. So here we go. In order from my favorite, we got Bulbasaur, Charmander, Pikachu, and then Squirtle last. These are awesome sets. You can get all of them for under $100 to catch up on sale. You know, I got mine at Target. I had all four of them at the same time. I think I paid 80 bucks. Plus I got like a gift card of some sort, $20 a piece for these things. Is great value. $25 is a good value, but if you can get it on sale, that's the way to go. Let me know what y'all think. Slap that subscribe button. If you enjoyed this video or videos like this, please let me know. Leave some comments, like the video, all that good stuff. Let me know if there's another mega set Pokemon, maybe Halo related, that you would like for me to review on the channel.